All right, so it looks like uh, you can probably see we have bricks and sand and mortar here now. So we're finally going to get some brick on the house. We're super excited about that. Wanted to see if I could educate you guys a little bit and y'all could learn a little bit from my experience out here working on the house. Number one, did you know there's different size bricks? A lot of builders use queen size, some use king size. Just for your reference so that you know it's more economical to use a king size brick because spread out over, I think our house is about 29,000 bricks, spread out over 29,000 bricks, it's significantly less brick because if you use a queen size, we'd have to have a lot more than that. So using a king size brick, especially in this market to where prices are off the charts, could definitely save you some money, make it more economical to build your home. Uh, so be mindful of that. And the next big thing that I've really learned is that mortar makes a huge difference. I looked at multiple houses with this brick on it with different color mortar and the homes look completely different. If they were side by side, you would not think that they were the same brick. So be aware of that if you're driving around, you're looking at different brick and you want to know what your house is going to look like with the brick on it, make sure you note the color of the mortar to get the effect that we wanted. We're using a white mortar here for our brick to lighten everything up and uh, we think we're going to be real excited with it. So I hope those tips help you out. Figured I'd throw that out there for you all today, especially if you're looking to build a custom home. If you need anything, feel free to reach out.